Yo, what's going on, survivors? Welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be going over some of the best rat holes and mesh holes on Ark Survival Ascended Center Edition. But before we get into today's video, let me tell you about Project Rose. Project Rose is an eight man no wipe server with very balanced server stats, player stats, banned items, and boss fight requirements. It's literally what small tribes should be. I think personally, as a person that played a lot of small tribes, it was really hard starting up. You know, you got people building artifact caves and like that. But with Project Rose, you don't need artifacts. You just need tributes. And it's still grindy. You know, it's, it's like I said, it's a 5X, but it's literally what small tribes should be. It's hella balanced. I really think you guys should check it out. I'm actually playing myself and player pop almost hit 100 players. So that's pretty insane. I really recommend you guys come through. The link to the discord is going to be in the description below and in the pinned comment. Make sure y'all join up. Without further ado, let's get in these rat holes. All right. So for our first rat hole, it's located by the ice palace um, in the ceiling. Um, the quartz to this one is 32.6 latitude, 3.8 longitude. Here it is on the map. And I'm just going to go out real quick. So, you know. There it is right there. And this is one of my favorite spots. Uh, it's a crouch rat hole. You walk up here, you crouch, and then you can just literally walk right in. It's really nice and spacious. Uh, it's nice and flat up here. But there's actually two parts to this rat hole. There's actually another another entrance like uh, to another section of the rat hole right here. All you gotta do is crouch, you just drop down. It just keeps going, it gets even bigger. That's what she said. <laughs> so it's pretty, pretty cool. Even goes way down there as well. So I thought that was pretty cool. And uh, to get out, you actually have to grapple out, and you need to crouch while you're while while you're grappling. So if you crouch, grapple up, you'll come right out, and that's how you get out of that part. What the fuck is that? Oh shit! Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. That scared the fuck out of me, bro. <laughs> All right, for this next rat hole, uh, it's going to be located uh, 16.5 latitude, 48.3 longitude. Here it is on the map. It's literally next to Pearl Cave, I believe. And uh, all it is, you come right here, crouch, and you just drop down, and you just keep following where it drops down at, and you, it just keeps going. And honestly, I'm going to be honest with you, I think this is the best rat hole in the game, um, period. It's hella unrateable. And this, this rat hole is massive. All right, it it shouldn't even be. It shouldn't even exist. It, it shouldn't even be in the game. But this is just massive. It just goes on forever. It, it it's flat, spacious. It, it's ridiculous. It, it's hella op. It's like lava mesh here, which it's kind of weird. But yeah, just goes on forever. It's pretty cool. Um, I even put down foundations just to let you guys know that you can build here. Um, it's legit. So you can even build on here on official servers as well. well uh, all these rat holes and mesh holes you can build in on official servers as well. So, And the only thing that sucks about this spot is that you got to to get out of it, you got to use uh, grapples. Uh, either grapples or a tech suit to get out. Which, I mean, once you get tech, you get t uh, teleporter, you're, you're chilling pretty much. All right, for this next rat hole, it's located in the floating islands. All right. It's going to be 40.2 latitude, 25.8 longitude. All right. There it is on the map. You're going to go to the floating islands. You can look for this waterfall. There it is right there. This rat hole is a little underwhelming. It's not the best, but if you're a solo, it's decent. It's a good starter spot. So another crouch spot. You just crouch, walk right in, and, you know. It's a good little starter base. I mean, fit a couple forges in here as well. And at the server, if, if you're on unofficial and you have mods, and you know, you can fit a lot of the small structures in here as well. All right, for this next spot, it's in the lava cave. All right, it's going to be located 17.5 uh, latitude, 55.5 longitude. Here it is on the map. And basically, you're going to go where all the lava is. There's this little, like, section of like land here you're gonna look for and it goes right the fuck it goes right here i just thought this was pretty you can actually fly in here as well especially if you're on unofficial little crack you can actually build on this if you put found like foundations in the wall like triangle foundations in the wall 
um, you can actually build out with ceilings have you have yourself a little decent spot it's actually a little bit of space too man you can fit up fabricators forges and stuff in here as well so pretty decent hidden spot in my opinion all right for this next rat hole it's literally right next to snow north snow north over there um, it's located 19.1 latitude 20.4 lat uh, longitude here it is on the map and all you're gonna lo look is for a big pillar and a small pillar uh, this rat hole is gonna be located on the small pillar right here and you're just gonna look for a big ass hole um, in that pillar and it just it's kind of a it's a pretty big opening but there's a lot of space in here man and even the even the bottoms a little flat as well I'm dropping flame frames like a crazy right now holy oh my god This is exactly why I use I and I. Yeah, look at that, we're good. But yeah, this spot's not too bad. Opens up really big, nice and it's flat at the bottom in some on some areas, so it's not too bad. And then this next spot is actually right next to uh, this one. So that's the spot we were just at. This next spot's actually on the other small pillar which is this one. Uh, this spot's gonna be located 18.8 .8 latitude, 17.8 .8 longitude. Here it is on the map, but it's literally right next to the other one. It, literally, it's it's a hole in the pillar, just like the other one. But in my opinion, this entrance is a little bit smaller. And it actually looks kind of the fucking same. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, but. Such a stupid ass. Anyway, same entrance, basically. And it just, like I said, it just keeps going. You know, you got a little bit kind of flat at the bottom, but still a decent spot, not bad. All right, for this next route hole, it's gonna be located 46.4 latitude, 24 longitude. Here it is on the map. It's right next to the floating island. Floating island's over there. And all you're gonna look for is a crack that goes in the wall. And you literally just drop down it just goes forever literally pretty OP spot and had to put foundations in here because uh, I get lost because the spots so fucking huge but literally it just it just goes on forever there's two sections so it's a pretty interesting spot not bad yeah, good luck getting out. It's like a maze. I get lost. I'm fucking freaking out. I'm claustrophobic. Alright, for this next spot, it's located at the Floating Islands. It is located uh, the, It is located 35.6 latitude and 31.3 longitude. Here it is on the map. And literally, it's on the Floating Islands. You're going to look for a big opening here. And... It's a it's a big entrance, but quite a bit of space, and it also goes down as well. There, not the strongest spot, but quite a bit of space in here. Nice and hidden as well, so that's the only entrance that you'd have to defend. So this next spot is underwater. I thought I would throw a couple of a couple underwater rat holes in here. Um, this spot is located at the bottom of the bottom of the ocean at uh 32 what the fuck am i talking about 32 does that look like a fucking 32 to you bro it's located 13.5 latitude 80.9 longitude here it is on the map all right so you're gonna have like a big ass like flat area right here right and then over here here's the actual rat hole itself you're gonna look for a crack in the ground and I'm gonna be honest with you, for a for a for an underwater rat hole, this spot is hella hella op. Really really small entrance. I don't even think I don't even think you can put a car bone through that. You might be able to barely, but not sure. 
but really big ass spot man if you get vac compartments in here with tech turrets yeah you'll be chilling big big chilling but definitely fit two cells in here for sure all right for our next spot uh this spot wasn't too crazy um it's not nothing too fancy like i just thought it was cool kind of cool and interesting but this spot's going to be located 35.7 latitude 24 longitude here it is on the map it's right next to the floating islands in this waterfall and you're basically going to go under here and there's a little gap here and it actually goes up to like a air bubble like a, like you actually could Good build up here. I mean, it, it's it's not, obviously it's not the best spot, but I just thought it was interesting. It's a little, little cool, little cheeky spot, I thought. Store loot or do whatever you want, really. And then last but not least, um, for our last rat hole, um, this rat hole is located 33.2 latitude, 29.7 longitude. Here it is on the map, again, next to the floating islands. And to get into this one, you actually got to grapple in. I can't find another way. Uh, you might be able to text it in with boots, but not too sure. But when you when you do grapple in, you do got to crouch and grapple in. And you'll go right in. Pretty OP spot. Uh, that's the only way I know of you able you being able to get in. But it just goes up pretty much. But yeah, put cliff plats in here. Um, even build off foundations. I mean, yeah, so like this, like for an example, not bad, you know, like not bad space for like a solo. All right. So now we're going to get into all the mesh holes for you little cheaters out there. Personally, I don't really care about mesh holes. Uh, they literally shouldn't be in the game. Should you build the mesh? No, but I mean, they're in the game. So, I mean, do what you will. Uh, but for this first spot, it's going to be located 31.9 latitude, 3.8 longitude. Here it is on the map. It's going to be in the ceiling. So you just go right here. You can literally fly into it. It's ridiculous. And here we are. Oh, yeah. Look at that. We're in the mesh. Gotta love it. All right. For this next uh, mesh spot, it's located 89.7 latitude. 31.9 longitude here it is on the map it's actually in the redwoods uh, this spot's a little weird i actually found this on accident uh just by messing around but you're gonna see like this crevice inside of like a rock formation right here and actually you're just gonna go right here and you're just gonna like literally just drop down and it's gonna literally put you right in the mesh it's kind of crazy like i said i found this on accident it literally just throws you into the mesh I like guess it's actually kind of crazy. All right, so this next spot is located literally on the side of the floating islands. It is 36.3 latitude, 30.5 longitude. Here it is on the map, literally on the floating islands. You're gonna see a large entrance right here. And uh, I mean, you could say it's a rat hole, but the entrance is too big. But this spot is fucking massive. This is like a big ass cave that leads into the mesh. I'm actually surprised this isn't patched honestly but nice and flat but like only downside is literally obviously you're in the mesh it's, it's ridiculous that this is even still even in the game and it goes on forever you know what i mean this is an insane spot that shouldn't even exist all right this next spot's gonna be located next to the floating islands in the waterfall um the courts are 34.9 latitude, 24.2 longitude. Here it is on the map. And all you're going to look for is a crack in the wall. It's a little small crack in the wall. There it is right there. And, and yeah, did you look at that? We're in the mesh again. All right, so for this next mesh spot, you kind of got to work for it. All right, it's gonna located 89.5 latitude, 63.9 longitude. It is in the redwoods. And you're basically going to see this, this crack in the wall right here. Um, you're actually going to need a, a, a chair for this, actually. So when you do get your chair, you're going to put your chair on on the edge of this rock here as possible. Where this hole is, you're going to place it, sit in the chair, get off of it, pick the chair up, and then you're just going to wait till you, wait till you glitch inside the hole. So this might take a, it might take a minute, but 
eventually you will fall inside the wall. And look at that. Oh, yeah, we're in the mesh. Gotta love it. But that's pretty much gonna wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. She did it at the